Okay, let's welcome everybody. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us today on Thursday Live. Today, John is in Mexico for another function. But of course, we have in front of us uh, the beautiful couple all the way from Italy. We have Geo brand ambassadors, Giovanni Balzarani and Leticia Monacelli Balzarani. So they're going to lead our session for today. So without much ado, Gio, kindly introduce us to our topic today. Okay. Hello to all. Um, welcome to my all the world in my hot studio. <laughs> <laughs> it's very terrible today. And um, this topic, I suggest we, I talk with John um, for the magnificent uh, Primate Tech series. And today I re realize or try to realize the marble effect with the Primatech color on wet on wet and use the, the pastel tone inside in the Primatech color with the, the titanium white. I apply these techniques because I remember my, my past job or, or job or restoration job when I replaced the, the marble in the, inside in the church. The Primatech is a beautiful, beautiful color series uh, because uh, um, for, the, for the artist it's very important I have this color because I, Okay, I, this is my character. It's very beautiful because it is a directly effect for the for these techniques. And, uh, for example, in my style, my hyper realistic style, I create the, the marble left uh, only the simple tone. I prepare, for example, in my painting under the seven, the the rust and the um, effect in the the bridge. Uh, not with Primatech color, but I apply simple, uh, a simple green in this painting, for example, is done on the stone. Uh, I created them only with the simple tone, but with the Primatech is completely different. It's very, very beautiful. The Primatech, for example, is another painting when I use the, only the Primatech color. The granulation is very, very beautiful. This is lapis lazuli. This lapis lazuli. So the light. So the light. And sleeping beauty. Three beautiful color. The Primatec. Okay. I show the the stone, my little collection. So a sleeping beauty. This is a sleeping beauty. Turquoise. Turquoise. Very, very beautiful. This is lapis lazuli. The famous lapis lazuli. Okay. This is a uh, 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 blue apatite. Blue apatite, yeah. This is soda light. Soda light. Oops. The beautiful black tourmaline I use, um, for example, in the sequence with the, the, the another um, dark color with black tourmaline, bloodstone, and hematite for create a uh, beautiful marble effect. Rhodonite. Red fuchsite. Red fuchsite. Another beautiful color. Okay. Amethyst. The amethyst is very beautiful. This is a transparent violet. Hematite from Utah. Okay. Hematite is iron. Is hematite from Utah. Iron effect. 
is very heavy. This little piece is one of the dark color beans of primate color. And the last one, there is a, it's a green, dark green, it's Jedi. Jedi. Okay, now I'm starting for create the base color of Primatech. Starting, for example, I selected the um, three combination, and I use uh, all. In, in this case, I use the half pen. I squeeze the the tube in my palette, but I use um, the half pen, but in support the watercolor sticks for the uh, create the line and the little detail similar to my style. I selected three combination. I for the first combination is a um, red and violet color. The second combination is green. The third combination is a blue. And for combination, the last with the three uh, dark color, hematite, bluestone, and black tourmaline. I show. Black tourmaline, that's mode. For example, black tourmaline, hematite, and bloodstone. Bloodstone. Bloodstone, sorry. Sorry for my English. I started for the first base. Apply, for example, in a two mode. The first is a wet on wet, but only the water. And the first is a rhodonite. We get the base with the amethyst second color for. The Dennis and we might chopstick, little chopstick. Apply more for the night. Okay. And the, the third color is Suji Light. Of the first three ants. For feed the point, dark point. And the little drops. When I waiting to dry, I apply them another level in this case, but I use the, the base wet or wet, but the titanium white base. Why? 
because uh, I created a little tone, pastel tone. With more, more water. I apply it more layer because it's very hot and dry, very, very fast. Okay. And to restart with Rodonite. Amethyst. And so you like. I create the little text group. Little difference if I zoom with the uh, I use the in this case only water in the, in this case the titanium white with, okay. with the, the, the base. I created this soft pastel tone inside. This is a all the base for uh, the detail after dry, but the the base is different to approach for more strong detail or more soft detail. In this case, now in this part uh, is dry apply the sugilized strongs for the denuis. or with brush pointing. Amethyst. Or dark color. I more dilution. Is a violet, dark violet. And some I think. create a little texture and I use the light, strong light after to create the part of light inside in the marble.
connection. So, what multiple effects in primitive? And the, with the base, white base is more soft and apply the line. It's really like in this case, more and more soft. I have a different base for my texture. The, in this case, with the titanium white base, the color down the saturation more 50% when dry. Like this, more white. For our friends here in Zoom and in Facebook, if you have any questions or mixing requests, remember it's Thursday Live and John would always welcome questions or mix requests. You can just type, type them in the chat in Zoom. And for those in Facebook, you could help read out uh, your questions for Giovanni and Letty. Is it a simple connection and check the difference with the different beans? This is the, the first three ads. Okay. Take a, another run. In this case, I in apply the, the green selection for the marble effect or simple texture effect. Like the water. And the base is the upside. And serpentine, the goetite. I should be in better mode. The upside is the base, serpentine, and rhinopatite. Sorry, rhinopatite. Okay. Giovanni, um, what kind of paper you used? Well, in this case, uh, I use the um, 300 grams um, Fabriano Artistico. But for the, um, this technique is better 6,400 grams because the thickness um, is, can I help for the uh, more, more, more water. And did the color um, more granulated um, on rough paper? No, in, in this case, I use the um, fine, fine green. Okay. Because the um, rough paper is a different texture, obviously. Okay. This is a yeah. rough paper, for example. Yes. I, now I, I, I try the, the similar techniques in a different paper. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. It's different because the inside in the, in the rough texture creates mm -hmm. another texture. It's beautiful, okay? Yes. It's very 
for example, in the rough paper, the, mm, the color mm, explained it very, very fast. But in this case, in the, the mm, fine, is it the, the line is more more perfect. Mm -hmm. And the second color is serpentine. For example, now I use the water for creating the text. So the serpentine is a little yellowish color. One of um, the color is uh, from lapis lazuli, uh, one of my favorite, and the hematite because hematite I have a beautiful granulation. In this case, the difference when applying the rough paper with more water. I have the different texture. Okay. The line. I stress the paper to color or create the line. But it is possible to apply the third color in green appetite. The, the part of it's very interesting to play with primitive color because there are many many possibilities for For example, I apply plus the little point of lamp black. Okay, when I'm waiting dry, I started with 
the titanium white base in this case. Apply my base. Let me the upside. Check the difference when I apply the, the titanium base serpentine. Okay, and the green apatite. It's very soft. In this case, for example, for the Little drop, don't use the lamp led mother hematite. Little, little drop. Move for the line. Is the marble venue? The marble effect is a long process. Thank you for the, these techniques master in Italy, the, the master Angelo Gorlini from Milan. I use these techniques for the beautiful painting bamboo. with bamboo and In this case, I create the line values with hematite. And apply the point color with white. Okay, I'm waiting to dry for the next detail. And now I apply the, the last three of, uh, with blue color. Okay. And I use the, I select the soda light, lapis lazuli for the base and Mayan blue. 
played it. What was that? In this case, I play a lot of water or have a huge granulation of soda light. So that I, I select it. Earth and Lapis. Very soft and beautiful color. This case uh, mm, is different to, to check this marble after with the texture. Because the mar the, this test is a base for the beautiful marble effect. Okay, and Mayan blue for the Point. When I'm waiting to dry, I move it. The water for mixing the base. And I use the and in this case, I use my sea sponge for removal. The quantity of water. And now apply the base with titanium white. Okay. Very fast drying. <laughs> So the light. And create with Tanya White this beautiful blue gray. This, this lapis. Very light. Mayan for the point.
Those colors work so well together. Yeah, yeah. That's one of them. For example, in this case with titanium white base, I have a more quantity of color and created this line. For another beautiful texture. And if you want, apply the little drop, for example, for another strong blue, blue appetite. more big is infinity possibility for the base in this case when after dry applying I take the brush sorry I use this brush for the line Will create my Venice in the marble. And apply the, the white. It's a long process, but it's very funny to create every part of marble surface and texture. Okay. This is an example for you. Remove the excess with the sponge. And when I remove the excess with the sponge, take the sign with my chopsticks before. Is go up yeah. and with my brush and the hematite in this case. Create more strong line. The marble effect is important. Follow the line of the stone. Is impossible, for example, have these and these. Is it natural? <laughs> Apply the white. Let's 
Okay. Now I try the last three of, but I use the, not the white with the color, but I use the masky fluid before or create the, the bennies in the marble. Is the blue, sorry. Okay. For the first, for example, I created this line with masking fluid, very simple. And in this case, I created it similar to spider net. <laughs> and I use only the three dark color. And the first is a hematite, bloodstone, and black tourmaline. Not wet on wet, but directly with the color. Okay. Is bloodstone. And black tourmaline. Another hematite for more granulation. I created the dark near the line with black tourmaline. Well, there's so much granulation happening there. Yeah. It's very beautiful. Yeah. This is a, a base mark, but when I dry the effort for uh, creating the detail is very interesting because, for example, it's possible with a small brush create the little venue near the point, granulation point. In this case, it's wet on wet, but when I dry, it's very beautiful effect. Yeah. This little, little venue. It's crazy, but it's very fun. <laughs> okay, I'm waiting to dry. In this case, I use the hair color is a Garnet, Minnesota, and Mummy Bautzite. It's Garnet. Excuse me, uh, Giovanni, can you, in, in the first layer, in the first picture, can you, um... Um, the um, granulation effect, can you uh, take it with more water or less water? It's more water, it's more water. With more water? Yeah, yeah, or, or, okay. more, or more dilution color. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Is it garnet? Minnesota pipe stone is similar to Ghana, but is little different. Okay, and mommy bouncy. Okay. 
like more inside in the pool. In this case, I, I use another color with Piemontite for the metal line. Which of the permatex has the most granulation? Is uh, more, more. Uh, for me, it's black tourmaline or hematite. Thank you. You're welcome. Is an infinite possibilities for creating the beautiful texture of the marble, or studying the all the marble stone, or with your fantasy. Yeah, the colors complement each other so well. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, let's try that. This case. Uh, point of water. Uh, white, sorry. This effect, for example, is um, famous in Italy because it replaced the, the famous marble near the Verona city, is Rosso Verona, have a this effect, similar this effect. When I'm waiting to dry, I apply the dark line with black tourmaline. The Primatex series is a, I repeat, is a, have a infinity possibilities for creating the marvelous effect. Another layer with hematite. Point on why
applied a soft layer of white. And another point of black tourmaline. For create the, the gray tone. The best connection of titanium white, in this case, or Chinese white, if you want, with the Primatech color is a beautiful combination for soft effect, but beautiful effect. I've never considered that, but I'm gonna give it a try. Yeah. Okay, when I waiting one minute to dry, I continue the last, for example, now it's completely dry. Or apply the layer, in this case, for blue apatite. I get the perfect base and create the this effect. I created a little text with this sponge. The white. But with big brush in this case. I created a hole in the marble. When I dry this hole, I create the skyline near the white hole the shadows. But if you want, I create this line now on wet on wet. It's important that I use this type of brush as a liner or rigger for this movement for create the, the venus, the natural venus. Yes.
אוקיי. Okay, now I come back for remove the masking fluid. In this case, I used my finger, but it's a little humid. I use the gum. The color is literally humid, but it's okay because with the gum, I create the little movement of white. Yeah. Now it, the, the, this part is very, very, very small, but uh, try, for example, in my old job, uh, in the, I replace the uh, one meter square. I create the marble. The, the work is very, very fast. <laughs> one meter square is a lot bigger. <laughs> Giovanni, yeah. your work is gorgeous. Thank you, Angela. And listen, I I didn't um, I missed uh, when you explained this that you are working on. Is it what sort of black is that? Tourmaline. Yeah, this is a black tourmaline, and um, is a three strong color: black tourmaline, bloodstone, and hematite. Ah, okay, okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And the last with my big liner. The other liner, are they also Borcelli Bonazzi? Yes, yes. The first liner is very thin. Yeah. I create the shadow near the white. So that is this big brush I have possibility for little line and apply the big surface. A big rigger. Okay. And in this part with mommy about sight. I create the, this line up on the white and down on the white. Okay. That's very cool. It's very, very simple, but I have a huge possibility for create your marble effect. Fantastic. It's, it's very so beautiful. Thank you. Very, very many possibilities. The Primatec have a um, very two beautiful uh, things. Uh, have a texture, I have huge granulation and a, have a beautiful connection for all the Primatex for creating a beautiful, beautiful texture. Mm -hmm. Thank you for sharing. Thank you. Too.
Very nice. Thank you very much. Yes. Great job, Giovanni. You're welcome. And let so for tomorrow, uh, just before we mentioned about tomorrow's uh, live session, we will be sharing some of the images here up on our socials. And of course, the sharing, or if you have follow-up questions, you can also just leave comments on our Instagram or Facebook, and a discussion can just continue from there. Um, tomorrow, we'll have a special guest all the way from Sweden, his brand ambassador, uh, Julianne Carlson. So if you uh, if you can join us tomorrow at 10.30 a.m., that would be great. Julianne will share about her process, uh, process using watercolor ground, luminescence, and if, I'm, if I remember correctly, some hint of a watercolor gouache. So we look forward to seeing everybody uh, tomorrow. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, everyone. Thank you. Thank you, Giovanni. Bye-bye. Thanks, Giovanni.